us what really sets you apart. Great to have both of you here today. Yeah, thanks for having us here. We appreciate it. Uh, a lot of parents do their homework. They want to make sure, you know, their child is going to the right school. Um, starting off in preschool, I think, you know, we know just how important that foundation is. And then going through high school, I mean, we all went through high school. It's not the easiest time <laughs> in our lives. Uh, you have a big event coming up. I want to get to that in just a second. But you have really great academic programs, rigorous mm -hmm. programs. Can you talk about those and what people can expect? Sure, yeah, we have a comprehensive high school. We have a, a lot of AP advanced placement courses. Uh, we just year, just this year started uh, AP computer science. So it was a big push and a big uh, interest in computer and computer science and, and even into the cybersecurity that's been in the news recently. Um, AP chemistry, AP language, AP calculus. So I love those. We have advanced biology as well, which is not AP, but it's a, it's a, a hands-on biology course and love that. Students love that too. They're doing investigative research um, on their own. So designing their projects and, and then sharing that data in a public setting. Wow, yeah. talk about preparing them for college. Absolutely. <laughs> That's yeah. incredible. Yeah. And then in terms of the younger kids, talk about that program and, and what you head up. Yeah, we, we try to give them a well-rounded uh, education, Heather. And so a few things that we've added, uh, as Kevin alluded to, we added a coding uh, class after school for kids that they're really enjoying. We added a music appreciation class, so we, mm. we want to push kids out of their comfort zone and have them try something different. I had a mom uh, just the other day said uh, we were uh, hesitant or apprehensive about the music appreciation with our eighth grade boy, but he ended up loving it and they ended up uh, just enjoying that time, doing something different, doing something new. So, right, I love yeah. that you're offering that because mm -hmm. everybody should try something different and outside of their comfort zone. But it, it also goes back to the brain because I think music opens up those receptors, right? It makes yeah. it a little bit easier to learn different things. Absolutely, yeah. One of, that's one of the things I love about our high school too is that we have a, a fine arts. I mean, our, our musical theater and our drama program has been award-winning for the past several years. We mm -hmm. did White Christmas this year and, and won one of the best uh, uh, productions in in this in the region anyway this year so uh, and putting those together with the music um, it's, it's such a great bonus for for kids and for parents right I mean you need that happy oh, time yeah. mm -hmm. and it's such a good outlet too <laughs> yeah. really yeah. I mean singing nobody's upset after they sing That's right <laughs> everybody feels <laughs> better after they sing or they're True. part of like a musical yeah, production yeah. Um, yeah. And, and so but you also involve you know values and your beliefs how do you combine the two how do you integrate that into your program yeah so if parents that are looking for a Christian education with those values um, you know we have Bible courses but you know more than the coursework and I think Aaron and I would both say this and he can speak to this too it, that relationships are our classes are small, so you know maybe 20, 20 students, which is way smaller than, than other options out there. So kids get to know their teachers and vice versa, and get to walk through them through difficult situations in life um, that, that they come across. And so um, building those relationships is really key for, for us to connect students and, and, and trusting adults. Mm -hmm. Right, I mean, because kids can get lost, especially mm -hmm. during this time, and the bullying is such an issue nowadays, especially yeah. when it involves social media. But you can address that kind of in a one-on-one -on -one situation, would you say? Right. Yeah, our, it starts with our teachers, Heather, our faculty and staff. Um, they relate to the kids. They're available and approachable. Um, they make time uh, before school. Uh, we have a, a middle school teacher that opens up his room and the kids come in and, and play with, uh, mm. get to hold snakes and, and yeah. get to just talk to each other and enjoy time together. Um, but when those those tough times come up too, our mm -hmm. teachers are available. Um, elementary, preschool, all of them are there to hear the that's, kids' needs. That's yeah. a parent's dream, you know, mm -hmm. and a child's dream too. Yeah. Let's quickly talk about the big event that you have coming up. Yeah, so at the high school, our big admissions event is called Take Flight Night. We're the Eagles, so we have to, of tie, that, we have to yes. tie that in with flight. <laughs> so yeah, so it's our big uh, push for uh, potential incoming freshmen, eighth graders from our middle school, but also other families that are, are looking for change, looking for uh, information about our school, so that's on Thursday at uh, six o'clock at our high school just up the street. Wonderful, yeah. I see you can you know go in, feel comfortable, mm -hmm. get a real feel for yeah, it. Yeah, meet people, meet teachers, and, and, and kind of just hear about some of the things we do. Yeah, it's gonna be life-changing. Yeah. Thank you both for being here hey, today. Of You're welcome, thank yeah. you. And take a look at your screen here. There are a couple of very important dates coming up for students. For more information, you can visit their website, desertchristian.org slash admissions.